Okay, boat anchor CB radio repair here with a a, a cheetah a cheetah side band two. Okay, I forgot to make a video of this when I unboxed it and everything. So uh, make a quick video here. It's pretty nice, I guess. It needs to be cleaned up. And uh, I plugged it in and. Uh, it worked until I turned this and it was it was making weird noises like when I would, had it on AM it was working <clears throat> and it keyed up I believe but when I started to uh, turn this like this it would go uh, it would sound like this it would go and then it just quit so I sprayed all the controls, buttons, switches, it's got channels, it's an 858 chip. This is a Cheetah 2, so it's got the completely different innards. Uh, it's got the same case, metal carcass. And there's a bunch of stuff that's the same, the power plug part, and this I believe. And uh, this one's got the 858, so let's check that out. An 858. Hmm, it's weird. So you can't see the chip because it's under this foam. So, uh, yeah, there's a crystal there. There's a pot down in there next to the crystal. Uh, some cans, a couple of more crystals. I would think one's for AM, one's for lower, and one's for upper. I don't know which one's which. I don't have a schematic. And it uh, looks pretty clean inside. It does look clean inside. Okay, let's plug her in and see what happens. I don't know. I don't know what's going to happen. Anything could happen. It could. Oh yeah, and I. I went ahead and cleaned the uh, relay. It's the same relay that's in the uh, <clears throat> 138 XLR, but it's not the same board. And this isn't a Washington board unit. It, it's it looks different. It's got a 1306 and 1307. Um, it's just it's different. The board. Uh, it's white. It's got white. When a unit and board is not like that. Let's get this out of the way. Okay, so let's uh, let's plug it in and see what happens. There's the SWR board, meter board. Yeah. Um, yeah. You know what? I don't think I did clean this, but, you know, we'll see. Hold on. Stand by. Okay. Uh, plug. Power. Hot. Ground. Okay. Hot. Ground. Okay, and all right, here we go. Let's see, speaker is over there, so it should work. SRF, uh, PACB, okay, <clears throat> blanker off. Uh, okay, here we go. R up, up all the way, squelch down all the way. Okay, AM, I don't need a mic. Okay, here we go. I'm going to turn it on now. Oh, is it on? Well, okay. Uh, oh, <laughs> stupid me. I remember I took these out to test something else. Okay. 
All right, it's on now. Hear the pop. So the speaker is working. Um, RF all the way up, volume up. So, yeah. That's a shame. It was working, then it just stopped. Um, nothing's hot. Uh, hmm. Okay, let's let's put a mic in it. Let's put let's put this mic right here in it. This should work. Of course, it should be receiving now, but it isn't. Uh, okay. Now well, that part's working. Uh, uh, let's check PA. Let's check the PA. Let's see, is it this one or this one? Okay. Uh, 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 okay, hold on. It must be this one here. Okay, so the PA is working. The PA is working. Okay. And this is external speaker. CB. So it is popping. Uh, 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 nothing. Huh, what a shame. Because this, this is a nice radio here. Yeah. Uh, 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 nothing on the meter. Nothing. Uh, uh, uh. Uh, uh, yeah, I don't know. It could be something in the box here. I just don't know. This is a mystery machine here. Mystery machine, yeah. Because it, it was working and now it isn't. Uh, when I turned this, it made weird sounds. That relay down there is relaying. See? This one's working. So. Yeah, it could be a dead cap. Um, it could be. I don't know. Could be. I'll just say that. It could be. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Uh, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, uh, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 17, uh, oh, about 30 caps, somewhere on there. Yeah. What a shame. And there's a cap there. It's in the box, too, so. Yeah, but it's hard as hell to get to. This one would be kind of a bear to, there's another one down there. Uh, yeah, right there. That one and that one. And this one's underneath stuff. I guess, yeah, I mean it could be done, but... Oh boy. Okay, so there you go. This is the problem with the here, Simpson Cheetah 2. Um, it just it don't work. I don't know what it is. I thought it might have been in the switch here, but I don't know. Like wires touching or what, but I didn't touch any of that. Out of 
so there it is. That's the problem with the Cheetah 2. And uh, at least it ain't smoking. <laughs> okay, there you go. Boat Anchor CB Radio Repair with a, a video, finally, of the Cheetah 2 that I forgot to take and I'm just now taking it. Okay, Boat Anchor CB Radio Repair, and we're out of here. Bye-bye.